they do not raise very critical issues which must be raised. Uh, and they raise, by the way, actually they raise headlines. Headlines, headlines, headlines. And, uh, meaning they are being led by newspapers. Uh, we don't want uh, parliamentarians that are led by newspapers. We need them to raise their own issues, which are not reported anywhere. And you hear them for the first time in parliament because they are doing their work. They discover certain things and they need accountability on those type of things. Uh, to the shock of everybody, how did these people discover such a thing? How come we didn't read about it in the papers? We can't be led by newspapers. We must be led by elected uh, parliamentarians in terms of raising issues and make parliament to debate and uh, have the executive held uh, you know, accountable and uh, that's how our people will then begin to have confidence again in the, in the legislature called parliament and all legislatures in South Africa because I don't think there will be a legislature in South Africa without uh, serious numbers from EFF. We'll, we'll take the last round uh, and, so, and then uh, conclude. I identified your hand. And then uh, yourself yeah, at the back. Clarity. Yeah, I, I was pointing that hand behind oh. you. Yes. We are pointing the camera man. Okay. And then, uh, and then you'll follow, and then you'll follow, and then you'll conclude. Yeah. Cool. Excellent. Shoot. Jason Williams from the Sun. I just want to know, is there a war for the Bidades? Because we've seen the ANC with the Bidades and now the DA is also adopting this style. <laughs> it's part of a new strategy. What do you think of the strategy? Yeah. Number two? Yes. Mr. Malay, I've seen that uh, currently there's no youth structure in the country. Do you still consider yourself a uh, voice of the youth? Thank you. How many how many seats are you hoping to secure um, at Parliament? Thank you. You say that uh, I'm young from the Berger. From the from the Berger. And you say and um, there's just uh, there should be a contest between the EFF and the TA. Why why do you think the ANC won't be part of this um, contest and how how will you change the entrenched voting patterns in the Western Cape, which differs from the rest of the country? Thank you. And the last question of the day. Uh, the DA has a very well-oiled PR machine. And since you're fairly new, um, do you think that you you have enough to go with now to, to unseat the DA here? Thank you. Uh, President, 